Hey everyone, Lenswinos here and welcome to another first look game. The game we're doing today is uh, called Journey of Life and it's by Hyperion Studios Limited. It's, I believe, a full release as of the 1st of February. Um, it's still very much under development as you can see by the version number at the top there, 0.9.0. 0 .9 .0. <laughs> yeah. um, I've played for a bit. It's different it's kind of hard to get into um it's not fully fleshed out which is why i don't believe it's an early access title but it probably should be if that's if that's the understanding i'm getting um currently selling for about 21 dollars australian whatever that converts to you guys wherever you're watching um yeah reviews on steam are mixed i can see why they're mixed um but it's it's definitely it's definitely got some promise it just you know for me so far just with a little bit of played um yeah it it, it needs some uh, some some bug fixes i guess um so here's, here's the map it's it's very it's very pretty um i'm not running it on ultra settings i was at the start but um had to drop it down to high especially when i was near a uh, there's a was a creek that runs through this area and um, started getting a fair bit of frame lag um, so long and short you're a uh, you're an engineer who's lost his entire fortune uh, forced to leave your home and start from scratch so there is a city over here I don't think there's anyone in the city I tried to have a bit of a look but um, couldn't really find any people so I'm not sure where the people have been added yet um, it's got, uh, you know, it's got a fair bit of uh, material added so far, and as you can see, there's, there's there's quite a number of bushes and trees and, and and different types of plants, and again, you know, things look fairly pretty. There's some animals over there. I don't know. I haven't got that far. Right. So first things first, you're gonna need some materials. A shiny thing over there. I'm assuming it's water. Um, you're going to need materials to build, but I'll just check out this, this area here. You can see some of the... Hello. Pigs in a pen here. I don't know if there's people. I only went over to the city and it's all walled off. And Let's have a look in this and see if we can do anything with this house. I don't know if we can use any of this stuff. No, it doesn't seem like we can use anything. So, ideally you want to find a spot to build. I don't like the fact that those, those piggies are over there. You can see what I mean about frame lag when you're getting near... Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Looking at my recording window, I need to get well away from that. Still very laggy for you guys. I'm getting I'm getting 35 FPS on my recording software. So you guys are probably getting a fair bit of screen tearing. I'm trying to record in, in 60 frames, which is what I normally record in, but uh, this game does not want to cut it. So I'm, I'm assuming it's, it's a little bit unoptimized. Let's put it that way. Uh, let's drop this to... Let's go medium for now. Uh, it's up at, oh, I was getting 50 FPS there for a second. I think it, it's got to be that, that, yeah, I get 50 when I face the way from the creek. <laughs> so, long and short of it is, you need to, and I do apologise if the stuttering is video, wow. Um, you need to get materials. The medium looks pretty rough. So let me just punch this bush here for a bit. Alright, and it drops a bunch of materials on the ground. Now, you can either like point at the item you want and push E to pick it up or I found you can open your inventory screen which is tab it shows you a thing here and if you've got items nearby you can actually just like drag them in or double click them and he'll, he'll pick them up we need a bunch of plant fibers pick all them up I'll grab the sticks for the moment we're also going to need some stone are you going to attack me? if you don't attack me 
Needs some stone. Let's go near him. If he attacks me, he attacks me. If I die, I die. I'm not super worried about it at this point. Hopefully they're... Here I am, punching the stone. It's Minecraft all over again. Okay. So we break these stone pillar things. And there's a little bit a little bit of a boat. Look at that. Some jagged rocks just floating in the air. Alright. So we need to craft some items. So there's, there's some tools in the game. We've got some stone axes. So this is in your inventory screen again. Stone axe, stone pickaxe. You've got fire starters. Stone, ha stone hammer is what you use to build things. Um, so on the ground nearby, when you're crafting, you can use items that are nearby on the ground. We've only got three small jagged rocks. So let's make ourselves... We're going to need some fibre rope first. So let's turn the 13. Let's make, I don't know, five of them. So you just click on this box here and it'll craft the item that you've, you've asked for. Alright. We're also going to need to get some clay, so we'll do that in a second. That's why I went near the, near the river, but that's tanking the FPS, and that's not good. Okay, so we've got them. Uh, I'd like to make a stone axe, please. Stone pickaxe, and I'm going to need a hammer. I haven't found these leaves yet either to make a backpack. All right, so that's that. And you can queue things up, which is what I just did. So I don't have enough stuff for the... I need a medium stick, maybe. Oh, no, here he's making it now. Cool. I missed the number that was there. All right. You've got your, uh, your, your toolbar here, so you can move your items onto here. Uh, like so. So we've got our three tools here. Probably want to... I'm going to take that small jagged rock. The rest I'm not... Super worried about. Now, again, I'm going to tank the frame rate here. I need some clay. I'm just watching my recall. So it's um, average to say at least. Let's try and not. I wonder if there's an option to like turn off. What can we do? I'd like high textures, but. Maybe drop some of them. Some of this. Turn that up. Tweak it a touch. Oh. Again. Good bad. No, you're not clay. I only found one. Right. No, you're not. You're nothing at the moment. Wow. 42 FPS. <laughs> Ooh. Are they the things I need for the... I'm not showing me anything. Uh, I only found this one chunk of clay here. So let's dig it up. I don't know. Use a... Oh, hang on. Point at the actual thing would be good. good start, eh? It's a little bit... A little bit weird in how it... Um, determines things. Got to look directly at the thing when it pops up so like that's all clay over there maybe that was a patch of clay down there i just wasn't looking at the right right thing all right so again nearby inventory it's grabbing five at a time i think you can only put in stacks stacks of 10. all right let's take this 20 clay In 40 FPS. In the 16% of drop frames. <laughs> uh, I want to build a little house. Um, I'll at least build an area where I can, can live. As I said, I need a lot of clay. Uh, I learned... When I was playing earlier, I learned you know, the bits and pieces you need to build. And... Turns out you need a lot of clay to build a house, apparently, in this game. So, you know, we're going to go over here. Um, I'm probably going to end up dying of thirst at one point, but I think I can get around that by making a... What have we got here? Handmade pot. 
Can I make one of these? It says used for transport of liquids. I wonder if I can use it to drink water. Requires baking. So that's that's a no. So it's fine. Okay, we've got some trees here. Gonna require a little bit of stuff. You know, you can just go on the ground for now. Alright, let's get uh, our axe and chop up this push. See the tearing of the graphics as it comes through. Uh, let's firstly make this. Can I make this? Some medium sticks and some fibre rope. Now let's make a workstation. Um, and to build this, I need to have eight medium sticks and two fibre ropes in my inventory. Gonna need a few more medium sticks. I've got four and two fibre ropes. Okay, I'm gonna need to chop another bush down. Maybe. I might be able to get from this tree. Yeah, it, it the game didn't perform too badly when I wasn't recording, so I'd say it's just the you know the the age of my my graphics card. It's not, you know, not super old, but it's obviously now getting to the point where it's old enough to start causing me some dramas while recording a game of this type. Let's put it that way. All right. When you've got your inventory screen open, you can, like as I said before, pick up items off the ground, but you can't, um, you can't use your tools. So in the case of this, I wouldn't have been able to chop at the tree with the inventory, inventory screen open. Yep. So, ooh, a lot of medium sticks in that one. Let's grab them all. Because they're going to come in handy. Let's build this little dude. Uh, I need my number three tool, which is the hammer. I think get close enough. Let's put in the sticks in. A little hard to see by the uh, size of the... Um, GUI but and now we've expanded what we can actually make so before if, if you looked when I did the inventory just in this crafting thing alone we've got some cloth fiber rope handmade pot and an air chamber they're the only things we can make but if we go to the workstation that opens up a lot so we can make some handles you can make molds for your um yeah pickaxes and head you know obviously that's hammerhead and an axe blade so there is a full forging system built in here, which, um, wow, 40 frames a second with a win with a menu open. It's got to be that, that river. Uh, opens up a few other things here. We've got pickaxes and, you know, made out of metal. Axes, hammers, etc. made out of metal. Bandages from cloth and um, backpacks, etc. So there are other machines or tool stations, I guess you'd call them, to make. We've got a furnaces and crushes and what do we got here? Great planks from logs. That's cool. Need a couple of logs and some fibre rope and you can make a station to, to cut planks. Um, some, some clay ore and some branches to make a clay kiln. That's probably not terrible for us. Like, it's a fairly large. It looks like it's falling over. Anyone else? There we go. <laughs> I don't know what was going on there. Um, that three. We'll put the clay in it. I don't know if we've got the branches on us, but we can get that. Building, building, building. Yep, I need five more branches. Here's some I threw on the ground earlier. So yeah, it, it's it's got promise. Um, again, apologies if your you know your video is a little stuttery. Yikes! Um, it needs two more clay, doesn't it? What does that need? The clay? Yes. All right. So we have a clay kiln with a bush inside it because I built it so close to the bush. Let's get rid of this bush.
Now the interface itself is a little weird. You've got these dots. So when you point at each of these dots, it gives you options. Um, you can see here this has no fuel in it, which has no fire. So if I get, I think what we can do, and I'm not sure if branches work, but what you can do is you can get, you can pick up a, a stick out of your inventory. I'm just left click and dragging. And I, I think you kind of, I don't know if you drop it there. Seems like you do. And now it's got 240 fuel in it. Uh, can it take branches? Let's see. Yep, so that gave another 30. So you've now got fuel in it. To light it, you would need a fire star, wherever that one was. There, yeah, here, which is just a couple of sticks and some fiber rope. I don't have the fiber rope. There we go. And then I could, I guess, take my clay pot that is on the ground here somewhere. There it is. We'll see if we can furnace it. All right, um, fire starter. So, four. Okay, so it's lit. Um, can I, like, take this? Do I put it here? No. Do I? Or is it being? Oh, maybe it's being furnished. Oh, that's weird. Can't, can't pick that up now. I'm trying to light the thing on fire. Can I pick that up, please? No. So now that I've dropped it in, <laughs> it's gone. Oh, uh, awesome! It says it requires baking. I probably should have thrown it in there. That's funny. Oh boy. So there you go, that, that, you know, like, you can see there is definitely some bugs. Um, can't pick up that. Can you put sticks in here? Drop it on top of it. That. I think you've literally got to put it in that spot right there. I assume that, you know, that'd be correct because your fire's at this end and then you heat end at that end. But I'm bummed that I put my clay pot down it's gone. Let's make another one. Because why not? Oh, I actually hit 60 FPS there for a second. Got a clay pot. What do I do with it? Can I put you in here? Does it go in there? Or do I lose it in there too? I don't know. Why is baking? It's in there being baked. Yeah, whatever. I'm, I'm over that. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So um, the building setup itself, uh, you've, you've got this button here for Q. Um, so you hold down Q and you can select the items. There's no real explanation of what you're building. So um, it can be a little difficult to get going with. And yeah, I like that's a ceiling. That's a ceiling. Uh, there is a, oof, there's a foundation somewhere. It's that one there, I think. Hello? Okay, cool. So then you can build, you build your houses in, like, modular squares, so to speak. So, if you want to build yourself a house, you need to lay out an area like this. And then we can push, push right click to get rid of that. And as you get close, you see you need two branches and two clay ore per one of these. So you can see why I needed the clay earlier, uh, which I don't have enough clay now. I could probably one clay in because that's all I'm carrying. I don't know if you can stand near branches. I think you have to have the stuff. Oh, no, it will pick up off the ground. That's cool. Um, but yeah, once you build that and then you can go ahead and build, and I don't know if I can do this yet, you build pillars. Like so. And go around and put your pillars down. And each of these is going to require the, the clay and the branches, apparently. And then we can build a door. And that has to go between two pillars. 
And then you can put a door in it. Hey. And so on and so forth. So the building system is fairly modular. And I'm assuming I haven't got as far as actually fully building a building. I've managed to work out how it works. I should probably put some windows in these, eh? Who who doesn't want a window in their house? Hey, we got one window. Everything else is <laughs> everything else is there. I don't know how to to delete a um a thing. Not sure how to get rid of a a, a, a template. Uh, roofs. What these are? Like? Uh, ceiling. Yeah. I can. Oh, how did I build a wall up there? <laughs> so then, this is probably really tanking my FPS. Yeah, it is a bit. We are skipping frames like no one's business. So then you, you get all your items and you, and you build it like you, like we did with the, the kiln here. We require baking. Hey, baked. I picked this one up here. Yeah? I now have a pot. I've, I've made something made a pot can I put that here can I because I'm about to die because I'm thirsty there's no warning no warning let's see if I can get down there before I die die of thirst hello can I five can I get a, some water can I drink no no oh I right clicked can I drink it oh I can drink it and drink it again. Look at that. Right click. Hey, there we go. I didn't. Well, that's kind of annoying. You right click to fill. Left click to drink. Tank the frames while I'm standing in the creek. But I uh, didn't die from thirst. That's that's a good start, right? All right. I think I'm going to wrap it up here, and uh, uh, again, I do apologise for the the I guess the lack of frame rate. Um, yeah, as I said, when I'm not recording, it's actually not bad. But the fact that I'm only getting about 45 FPS while recording, eh, it's not so good. Anyway, this was a journey of life. Made by Hyperion Studio Limited, released on the 1st of February 2021, which I'm assuming is into full access. Um, currently going for about $21 Australian, $21.50 Australian, it is actually. And um, if you like the look of it, go and check it out. It seems to be fairly well um, supported. That, that it looks like they're doing updates every couple of weeks. Uh, at least for the last few weeks, there's been updates every couple of weeks. Um, but yeah. Maybe it needs a little bit more time in the oven, like the uh, our little pot here did. Um, but until next time, thanks for watching. Comments below, and I will see you then. Bye now.